Body language has been extensively studied by Amy Cuddy, by Vanessa Van Edwards, and so many other psychologists and body language experts. Two little tips I've picked out from these psychologists are, one, the Amy Cuddy theory in which there is release of positive hormones when you are sitting in a particular posture. Now that posture is you clasp your hands in the front and take them behind your head and sit like this. And this releases positive body hormones in your body before you go for a public speaking assignment. It's obvious you cannot go around, uh, you know, dabbling in this kind of a posture in public. This has to be done prior to when you go out for a public speaking assignment. The other thing I gauged was that if your hands are spread out, they are spread out like this on the table when you're speaking and maybe you're leaning forward, that is supposed to be a positive indicator. It signifies ownership. But I, as a person who's been watching body language, feel that this spreading out of the hands and pressing on the table might be a sense of refuge for the person who's speaking. So I wouldn't really advocate it to be utilized wholeheartedly. If it has to be utilized, it should be utilized with a straight back and the hands to be posed like this while speaking to your audience and other things to be concomitant with a positive